All right, so in this video, I will be talking about uh, a lady and her husband and the kids that were involved in MK Ultra Ready since 1995. Uh, and the two somehow did not got married, all through young, good looking couple. Uh, back then in 95, the two somehow did not get married through meeting me, but did remain. You want to say loyal partisan whatever you want to say still i want to say thank you um i think it, to a good friend of mine and when i say this i also mean uh her husband also uh let's see what i have in it and before i do this uh, let me see something here quickly here it says uh the Bobby, Bobby was my name, Bob, Bobby, but they did refer to me as a dog. I was an animal dog, I was. Uh, it says here, the breaks world record for oldest dog ever. What What exactly is dog? Is that like people that are subject to MK Ultra? No, I don't think anybody can remember me for that. I told you, I would spend about one week, sometimes even two weeks, walking sleepwalking right here in the novel master would have americans lodge locally here locally here in the city of the novel master in slovenia locally would lodge and observe police breaking me down people such as alec baldwin hollywood people basically politicians will come here spend one week sometimes even two weeks watching me being breaking destroyed demoluted annihilated then delivered to united states of america which became my newly chosen homeland in 2000 became a citizen in the u.s yeah because it appears to me that every one of these heroes in hollywood all this nba famous rich and less rich that want to become rich they got involved in this crime which is actually a genocide. And what a genocide, boy. They wanted to portray through the terror clips. They would sell terror clips based on which, I think, based on the stress, degree of crime they would portray, they were able to accomplish through the terror. Uh, it's how they obtained opportunities and money, that kind of stuff. One, two weeks without sleep, and then redistributed internationally, intercontinentally, for trips that would last up to two months, during which probably I would get about maybe four times opportunity to sleep, maybe something like this, so that everything was administered by the physicians, all the cardiovascular health. But it was designed for me to have one destroyed, burned would not fall completely apart talking about those like four sessions of sleep i would get in between that's how they used to do all right so you're not going to remember me by bobby breaks the world record for all this dog ever i don't think i'm your dog really that's the one thing and um what i want to talk to you about this video is eventually as i stated earlier this issue here I see that the main news here is about Mr. Bill Clinton, uh, which is something that's related to <coughs> Bin Laden. That's an interesting because the friend I'm going to be talking to you about right now, uh, that's actually a Susan Rice. You know the Susan Rice? Have you ever heard of Susan Rice? Probably you did. She is not as famous as uh, uh, I'm going to say. Bill Clinton, I would say. But you probably did heard about her. OK. No, since I go over this stuff here, why don't I do something else here also? This here, you're going to credit me. You're going to give me a credit for 
Mongolia. I want the credit for Mongolia. Let me see that. This one here. Uh, the girl I have identified once she gave me a thumbs up. It's right here. The entire region along the Chinese border and northern Chinese and they actually entire China, sorry. But entire border along the Russian border with the Asian countries. Kazakhstan, Tajikistan, all the way to all the countries they border. Everything, everything that Russia border. Absolutely everything was involved in it. Uh, something for what the Russians insisted me. Vladimir Putin, Medvedev, Sergei Lavrov insisted me, if you ever going to go anywhere near Russia, down south, along the border, we're going to we're gonna send a team. While some Russians insisted to kill me, Vladimir Putin was very generous just to hijack me. So that's really nice. Okay, we're going to talk about... Yeah, this girl, exactly what you see right there. Uh, I want to talk about uh, Susan. Susan, 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 Susan. Oh, yeah. I, I'm, not I'm not really good with this here. Susan, Susan Rice. Here it is, Susan Rice. There you go. That's fine. That's a Facebook user, Susan Rice. Uh, we did spoke about some stuff here. Uh, yeah, she did really, really smart that she didn't give me a number. And uh, it's exactly the promise that she she held. And since this is related also to Bill Clinton, you're going to see through through the stuff here. Let me see if I can increase this so that you get the conversation. And I'm not going to be spending time on explaining this stuff here. This is a real Susan Rice. This is not this is not uh, a joke. As I said, her husband, uh, she was involved since 1995. These are extremely beautiful people. I think one of the most beautiful people, these were the people that were involved in it. And you're going to see my advanced knowledge also about Bill Clinton you're going to see my advanced knowledge about the fund, which was actually, I never was told who exactly was the one that opened directly Eurasian fund uh, management. But I think it was a Thailand king. I think it was a Thai king, the one who financed the procedure. Even what he stated back then, to help me out, yeah. So you see here, well, I'm Susan Rice, Director of Domestic Policy Council in the United States. So I didn't know exactly what this was all about. So I wanted to know whether, what, how is it government related or something like this, or is it like private or something? No longer is private. Susan wanted to help me out, uh, and so with permission of Bill Clinton, she did something like this. Hell, I remember absolutely everything from day one with Bill Clinton. With a police officer, he would have a long sight next to him. Uh, and I can tell you, based on my memories with the Bill Clinton, that uh, severe sleep deprivation, therefore cardiovascular destruction, already took place started to take place very early on in United States of America. When I was driving with him in the car, that was already very, very tough stuff that went on. I would go for days without the sleep. <coughs> so I'm talking about here, 1996, uh, I was I was really, really friends with Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton was my body really really good body um the thing is that the whole thing really went out of the control and i don't think that he liked this crime against me too much but it appears to me because of other people involved in this crime that he had less and less to say 
I don't think he had actually any, any say. You know? You see this consultant in Eurasia group and stuff like that. This is real Susan Rice. This is not a joke. All right, let me see if I can demonstrate to you. Oh, she has worked at United States National Security Advisor and is a 27 United States Ambassador to the United Nations. I like her. I like her. I um, I wasn't nice to her, though. I, I wasn't nice to her. I wasn't nice to her husband. Uh, the thing is that I figure out that I liked her. I mean, physically, and what I would frequently do is I would create problems to the guys, even husbands. I wouldn't know they were husbands. Fuck it. If the woman was good, you know, why not try, right? See how, what's going to come out, if anything, for me. Uh, and so, you know, I was like a little monkey that did all kinds of stuff. Uh, and so her husband just sort of fell victim to all this. Uh, but then I'm gonna say, then I'm gonna say, he knew that he knew that I'm not a bad person, whatever. Uh, and he somehow tolerated me. Uh, what he couldn't tolerate is was my crazy views. And I need to make sure that this appears like more like some kind of backup file or something like this. That would like huh. Gotta make sure about that. It's got 444 followers. It should be real. Uh, what the hell is it? Is it like that she's not known or something like this or what now? There is another Susan Rice here. Directed domestic uh, policy council. But you see, I have seven friends. Mucho. Let's see what else is here. Uh, you got anything else here? 27 how many profiles does she have she have a lot of profiles it appears maybe it's too damn popular huh okay it's susan writes all over the internet but i am talking about the right one uh, have i finished this stuff here um i'm gonna play that stuff one more time so the first thing I want you to get is idea about who Susan Rice is also before I'm going to go and I'm going to scroll down. So uh, listen, she wouldn't be talking to me about business and such if it wasn't the real Susan Rice. And I know it was a real Susan Rice. I know about the funds because I knew the directors personally that Bill Clinton involved. Bill Clinton was the one who started that foundation. And he started that foundation for the sake of the friend who was uh, the main person in there to help him out, but literally using this case, therefore meeting these Asian people, not only Russians, they would redistribute to one another opportunities to improve their personal lives. Okay, so that's how that fund Eurasian came to life. Yeah, about how she contacted me. So this is a quite popular lady. It appears, what is this here, 60 million results that she's more than not no, well known, I should say she is. Okay, so that this is this is established lady. This is not just anybody, just like this. So there you go. Ah, there you go. 
on a on a front page and on a magazine and so on all right so you know uh also it stuck to me somehow let's go and let's let, let me do the whole thing here i'm gonna go so interesting is she contacted me in respect to business opportunity job opportunity but she is what a special advisor at united nations or something like this what is she now let's see this Uh, Washington, previous national security advisor of the United States, director of the, oh, there you go, director of the Domestic Policy Council of, director of Domestic Policy Council of the United States since 2021. All the children were involved in it, which, let me see here, these are not children, man, these are grown-ups. This one here in particular. Okay, let me see that. What is this thing here? Okay, okay, this one here. Let me demonstrate. This is a grown up already, man. This is the one on the right side. That's that's uh Yeah, that one really, really liked me. Somehow. Uh, and father liked me a lot. Like I said, um, he was like, you don't know what my dad can do for you and this and that. He was, he appeared to be like really, really eager to help me out. And so that's, that's the beautiful family right there. I want to say thank you very much. I'm so glad to have you as my friend. And now let me go ahead and I'm going to scroll down here and let's see what this is like. Oh, I remember when they would pick me up and drive me all the way to Canada along. But the thing about me is I also remember about the, the direct about this Eurasian uh how he looked not only how he looked but his house when he got one and everything all that stuff simultaneously spoke here online now i'm a humorous person I, you might encounter me as a little bit maybe even too damn serious when i talk about uh you know when I go over this stuff, uh, but you got to understand about me that uh, I keep extremely positive humor because I wouldn't make it without it. I have to. Sometimes, um, maybe even a little bit too damn humorous, and uh, it could be eventually used to uh, interpret it in a in a very very wrong manner i did endure tremendous hardship i have endured uh but there's one thing i learned through these stages through these different fa phases i went through uh, i learned that detaching myself from uh, the normal way of life and the normal thing doesn't do me any good and i it, i just have to uh remain to accomplish the desired outcome exactly what i was i would become i would try all kinds of strategies uh just to realize that every one of those could easily be misused for other purposes so if you ever find yourself in situations such as mine god forbid or similar, doesn't matter. Just remember to be yourself. Stay you no matter what. Thanks for watching this video. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna give me a credit for this lady here. For this um, Ulan Batar lady. For my Mongolian sister. You're gonna give me credit for that one. 
I I did identify her. She would take me she would take me along the way everywhere. Uh, this government of Vladimir Putin is a problem for everybody. I think. I think this is this is an enormous, enormous problem for everybody. This is this is a problem. This kind of this kind of governing basically makes me you know it it breaks the world basically apart. You understand it's it's not connecting the world it's actually really really damaging for the human relations we don't we as a people we don't need to destroy to damage one another to hurt one another we don't we don't need this we need to connect each other we need to help one another so that we can survive this is a cruel world with the people like vladimir putin And it's not doing us any good. So this is a babe right here. I'm going to give her a heart like this. So you're going to also give me a credit for her because I did identify her. No, a part of the road. Uh, I am not sure if this is here, but I think it is. She actually drilled me if I go on the map and I really put attention, I can probably pinpoint this. Um, at least it would look like that, but I think it was all kinds of stuff that it was. If you're going to be like this, you're going to be like that. It's going to be... Blah, 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 blah. I hope it was the right picture. I hope I'm okay. Um, she had me here. She stopped. Not here. But a little bit I had, I think it was, that would get me out of the car as we would travel. I travel with her probably, maybe what, maybe maybe 50 times, maybe, to a Kazakhstan area. You understand me, what I'm saying? Through the China, sometimes they would skip me off over there in China and northern part of China and so on. I know the roads, I know the, 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 it's not only, enormous amount of people was involved in it. Yeah, this gorgeous lady was definitely involved in it. She's got a university degree, which I have properly also described, that kind of stuff, yeah, All that kind of stuff, you know. So, I identified her too, and so you're going to give me also a green light for Mongolia, for the Ulan Batar. Although I should know way more than that. I'm doing this just to prove you the point that there is nothing that would make me know anything about any kind of details in respect to her education or when she completed one or anything like this. It's important for me to also demonstrate you that kind of stuff. Is there like work and education? You can see here, nothing, nothing, nothing. Well, thanks for watching this video. Till next time.